Good morning, Northview. It is a great day to be you. Have you ever talked to a close talker? Somebody's got a real close up to you to talk to you? Hmm. Well, with everything that's going on lately, with our social distancing, we don't have to worry about close talkers anymore. Just those that talk close to us when we're right on the screen. Okay, that's a little bit... <laughs> Gotta adjust my eyes on that. <laughs> well, I hope you're doing well on this Tuesday, April 21st, 2020. What a day yesterday. Boy, we had some great sunshine. It even got warm up into the 50s. And then, wow, did that wind come. I don't know if you saw those trees, but man, they were twisting and turning and blowing all around with the over 50 mile an hour gusts. So hopefully you were safe. Um, we got a little r spring rain, so hopefully the trees will begin to bud and we can start to see some leaves on there because um, I'd love to see some greenery in, on our trees. I, I, how about you? Oh, good. I'm glad you feel the same way. Oh, boy, have I been loving seeing the photos of you and your pet. Wow. You know, if you don't have a pet, if you're outside and you see a bird, see if you can't get your picture taken next to the bird somehow. Or at least if it's flying by, maybe you get a picture of the bird flying by you. And then we can say, hey, that's your pet picture. No saying that you get a picture with your sibling and saying that they're your pet. None of those pictures, but good try. Um, send those, continue to send those pet pictures into Mrs. O'Connell, Mrs. Seipel, or myself. We absolutely love seeing those. Again, remember this week's photo challenge is you and your pet. All right. Also, Red Nose Day Joke Hathons. Keep those videos coming. I need more, more, more Joke Hathon videos. So please send them my way. I've loved seeing them so far. And I have some new jokes for our joke Fridays. We might even have to have it like a midweek joke, like a joke Wednesday or something. I don't know. I've got lots of jokes coming my way. But keep those videos coming. I really need your videos for the Joke Hathon for Red Nose Day. And Red Nose Day is May 21st, so it's coming up. It's actually a month from today. Wow, just realized that now. We have Earth Day coming up tomorrow. Um, my family, we already started. We got some flowers and things we're planting. And um, we're, when we're out for walks, we're looking for trash that we can pick up and, and um, recycle anything that we can. So Earth Day coming up. I'd love to hear about your ideas that you're going to be doing as a family. Uh, if you got some pictures of you doing some different things, I'd love to see those. So send them my way, okay? Awesome. All right. Well, our weather today. All I can say is that the bottom dropped out of the weather. It's going to be only a high of 44. It feels like 20 degrees already this morning. So it is definitely a chillier day. We're going to have a mix of clouds and a little bit of sunshine. Hopefully more sun will be shining through today with our northwest winds at 20 to 30 miles per hour. And they're saying it could even be greater than that. So if you are outside, be safe and uh, don't blow away with the wind, okay? All right, tonight, partly cloudy this evening. Oh my goodness, I can't even believe I'm going to be saying this. Then, snow showers after midnight. Oh my goodness gracious, snow showers. But the good news is, it's going to be after midnight, so we won't even see them. Hopefully, we're not waking up to something on the ground. And the low of 32 with the winds east-northeast at 5 to 10 miles an hour. Oh, I can't even believe I said snow on April 21st. Oh, warmer temperatures come quickly. Okay, lunch menu. Remember, free lunch for all families for that have children 18 and under. Please come on and grab a lunch up there um, at the high school from 11 to 1, Monday through Friday. Yesterday, this is amazing. Yesterday, we had over 100 meals that were picked up just in yesterday alone. We are so thankful that so many of you are, are coming on up there and, and getting these free lunches uh, for you and your family. So keep coming up, keep getting that, and don't forget to grab your milk that we have there as well for you. And if you're needing a little extra food, we do have some boxes up there uh, from our gracious friends in the Howard Grove community and the Sheboygan County Food Bank. So thank you, thank you, thank you for those donations and, and getting those boxes so that 
um, could be some additional food for some families who are in need. So um, if that's if that's you, then come on and, and, and grab a box of additional food for you and your family, okay? All right, happy birthday to all of you who are celebrating your birthday today. Oh my gosh, I am so excited for, to, for you today because you get to celebrate you. Wow, I love birthdays. And if it's your half birthday, I hope you're celebrating too because that is just a, another great thing. So happy, happy birthday to you. All right, continue to check out our Northview YouTube page. Share it with your family so they can kind of get up to date to see what's happening um, with the announcements for Northview. Check out the read-alouds. I have to apologize. I thought I posted yesterday's read-aloud for a scheduled time at 1 o'clock. It wasn't. It didn't get on until 4 o'clock. So I apologize for you uh, for that. So you have two read-alouds that you can check out today. And yesterday's book was 10 on a Sled, which is just one of my um, all-time favorite books just to get a chuckle at with animals that are in that. So check those out. All right. Oh, shout out galore today. Yesterday, oh, I had this great opportunity. I was working um, in the yard a little bit, and I and, uh, saw Lydia pass by and uh, with her mom in the car. And we got to talk a little bit, keeping our distance, absolutely. But it was just great talking to you, Lydia, and I hope you and your sister Nora are doing well. All right, here's some shout outs for some of the pets that I've seen uh, with you in your pictures. Claire and her adorable dog, Will and his dogs. Oh, Will, it was funny seeing you checking your dog's heart rate. Oh my gosh, that was so cute. What an adorable, adorable picture. And Lydia and Nora sharing a picture with us with their pet turtle. Oh, that was so cute. His little legs, I could tell they were just a moving. Um, Owen and Hope with their new dog. That was great seeing you guys. Great Great picture with some beautiful smiles there. Michaela and her kitten Stormy. I can't wait to see the video to where Stormy is and in, in, uh, in the picture with Michaela. That was cute. And Leah and Azalea, Ella and Spencer and their dogs. Oh, I just love seeing the big smiles with you and your pets. And I know you make the pets feel just so good. And we even got a picture with Mrs. Demon and her dad's cat. Wait till you see the size of this cat in the pictures. Oh my goodness. Today, is color day. I got my gray pants on. I've got my gray socks on. I got gray undershirt and black, which is, I think, a shade of gray. Um, and so make sure you got your colors on of gray today. And it'll match the clouds that will be out there, I think, today as well. All right, let's stand for the Pledge of Allegiance today. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right. Go ahead and find a comfortable spot for you to move into our mindful position. All right, boys and girls and moms and dads, aunts, uncles, pets, anybody else that might be around, siblings, Let's get ready for our mindful moment, okay? One hand, two hands. Put them on their laps. Sitting up tall with a long, strong back. Got a frog in my throat on that one. As you sit in your mindful position and breathe, think about our big idea color, gray. Keep your body still by moving your head to scan the room Noticing all the different places and objects you see that are gray. For the last few moments, choose one thing you found that was gray and focus on that object. Notice the shape and size of the object. Notice what shade of gray it is. What do you think it would feel like? Notice all these things and then check in with how you are feeling today. Remember that when we take time, the time to pay attention with kindness and curiosity to things we see we are being mindful. 
what a great thing to be thinking about today and to realize is that taking time with kindness and curiosity, the things that we see and how that is being mindful. Why don't we close our eyes and take three breaths in and out. Oh, good. I think I might have snuck a fourth one in there. I don't know about you, but I know I did. Yeah. All right, my friends. Remember the big three. Treat others right, make smart decisions, and maximize your potential. Remember, friends, you matter. Have a great Tuesday.